welcome thanks for tuning into my video so today i am happy you guys tuned in to unbox my new cricut air explorer i said that all wrong my cricut explorer air 2 machine and all my goodies i don't know how to use this machine so bear with me i'm gonna be learning that's why i'm doing this video i'm a beginner um if you are a veteran in the cricut world please feel free to comment on this video let me know your channel, if you have any videos of user-friendly, you know, posts that you've got so people can learn how to use the maker, let me know. I will tune in and watch those videos you have on your channel. You may be somebody I have already watched, who knows. But anywho, I got, like I said, the Cricut Explorer Air 2. I didn't get to get the lilac bundle, but I did get like, I guess it's lilac or lavender in color. It is really big, so I'm gonna insert a picture I also bought the Cricut tool set. It comes with a spatula, a weeder, a scraper, some scissors, and some tweezers. And then this right here is the scissor, the scissor cover. So I don't know if this is gonna, cause this little light I got going on is really bright. Next, I have some opal vinyl. Then I have some permanent glossy vinyl. And I have the transfer tape that it transfers the stickers. So today I'm going to try to make a sticker. <laughs> Good luck for me. I also have, uh, what is this one? The 12 by 12 standard grip mat. The Explorer already came with, let me read, it already came with the blade and the housing, a black pen, a large grip mat, which is the same as this one. I don't know why she told me to buy this one. Um, the welcome book, the quick star guide, the cable, the power adapter, a free trial membership, 50 ready to do projects. So let's get into this, okay? Cause I'm excited. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm in my chair. I have wood chairs. So let's move this stuff. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera. I've already downloaded the Cricut app onto my iPad. This is what I'm gonna be using. So let's just see if we're able to get through this and create something. So this is my machine. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this. I don't have anywhere in my house to craft, y'all. So I have to craft in the kitchen. Okay, so I see there is a difference in the mat. So this one is not as thick as the one the young lady at Joanne's had me buy. All right, so this is what it looks like in the inside. All right, so I have the Cricut out, and as you can see, it comes with a pencil, the cords. And the welcome book. And here is the Cricut Maker. All right, let me sit this down. All right, guys, so I got everything moved over. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy hooked up. It's so pretty. I don't know why I think everything is pretty. It took so long, didn't it? All right, so let's get the cup. All right, so I'm sure this goes in the back somewhere. Yep. Hold that in. And this 
is if you want to hook it up to your computer. But from what I understand, this is Bluetooth. So I don't need this cord at the moment. Turn the power on. All right. So I just turned the power on. I'm going to go ahead and open this. Oh, wait. Oh, no, my cord is... Okay, there we go. The cord was stuck in there and it wouldn't allow it to open. Remove this. And I'm assuming this needle is already in there. And I know somehow, some way this comes out, but I'm not going to bother that because I don't know what I'm doing yet. <laughs> so I'm going to leave that alone. And I do know your tooth can go in here. So I'm going to go ahead and see if that fits. That fits perfectly in there. I just put it in here. Sorry if you couldn't see. All right. So let's dig in. All right. So I'm just opening in the welcome bag. And you have a get started CD to put into your let me see, computer, maybe. I don't know. Nope. <laughs> just little cards one says unleash this beauty you get connected and make a little something and bookmark this page i was thinking i'm like you know a lot of laptops don't have cd holders anymore i mean you know cd players so i was wondering why it would be a cd in here but that's why i was like maybe it's for your computer okay should have pulled it out first. So it also has this sheet that allows you to go and get help or um, you can go to the YouTube channel. You can chat, you can call, whatever you need to do. Here's the book on how to get started. So they have an online guide. So you need to go to cricket.com forward slash setup so let's do that and this is what it looks like so all right now sign up to our diy holiday guide you'll get ten dollars off your first order of 50 so i'm gonna go ahead and sign no yeah sign in on here because i already set up an account all right, I am all signed in. I'm trying to get a good angle so you guys can somewhat see. You'll go, let me go back so you can see. You'll go to the Cricut app. Let me cancel that so you'll see. So then you go to your machine, which I have the Cricut Air. And then you want to make sure it's plugged in. Connect to your Bluetooth. It tells you the pin and you'll connect with it. So... Let me go ahead and connect. Make sure my Bluetooth is on. It is on. Pair it with the Cricut. So it's pairing. Oh, I said it was unsuccessful. It's turned on. Just make sure it's on and in range. Okay, there it go. So now it gives me the option. And I'm gonna do one, two, three, four, pair. And it's pairing. And it is connected. So now that it is connected, I'm going to go back and it says, let's activate your Explorer. And they're loading me up with the greatest features, they say. So as you can see, it's loading. We just have to be patient. Okay, guys, so it is done installing. As you can see, so we're going to hit continue and connect because it got kicked off. So we have to connect it again. 
Oh my goodness. It shouldn't be so hard to pair this time, hopefully. Okay, good. Continue. All right, so grab this Cricut Access plan and it will include 100,000 images for $10 a month, first month's free. Hmm, sign me up. All set for this particular thing. And here's the image. So it says the green Cricut Access flag next to an image font or project mean it's included as a part of your Cricut Access plan. Enjoy. So we're now limited to just the free stuff. Let's test a cut, select an image to get started. And I want to do the lips, of course. So next. Um, I'm, I have vinyl, so I'm going to turn this dial to vinyl and, oh, it says turn it to cardstock. Okay. So we're going to turn it to cardstock. Okay, I guess we can use this card right here. So I know I'm not gonna make an envelope out of it. Maybe the Paris part. So place card stock on the max top left corner. Setting. Oh, wait. No, it's, it's adhesive. So, wait. Hold on. I'm trying to line it up. So, we're setting it up. All right. I don't know if it matters which way we put the grip sheet in. With the open hook part. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, Next, it says prepare for a cut. Prepare for a cut. Confirm the blade is set in place into clamp B. So I'm just gonna open it. Make sure it's in there. Um, let's see. It's in there. All right, we did that. Next, it says, push the map under the guidelines, which we're gonna go ahead and do that. And towards the rollers, we got that. Press the flashing load on the machine. All right, y'all. And hit the cricket. I don't know how long I'm supposed to press it. There we go. And it's cutting, y'all. Uh-oh. It says it's almost done. I don't know if this thing's supposed to sound like that, y'all. Oh my God, I'm so nervous because I don't know <laughs> if it's cutting or what is it doing? you know how your progress is going so as you can see it says it is done 
Okay. Oh, oh. You have to hit the unload button. Oops. Oh, I see it. Ah, oh, I see the lips. Okay. Cute. It just cut my card stock into a lip, and we have just created our first design. Oh, see, that's why we have these tools, I assume, to help you get this stuff off with. So I don't know which tool we're actually supposed to use with these grip mats, because they definitely grip. But we have lips. <laughs> so now I gotta try to get all these little things off of here. I'm just gonna try to get these off of here with this the best I can. And this is really getting it up, so. Let's see that, oh, you guys didn't even see how easy this little tool just lifted this whole thing. So, there we go. Getting that off. And if I am not okay, supposed so to. So, as you can see, it cut the lips. I was able to go ahead and get all the stuff off of my mat. And this is what the little lip looked like. So now I'm going to go ahead and actually try to do a different project. Um, I'm back. I don't know. So many people want to interrupt me today, probably because they know I'm excited about a new toy and I don't want to be bothered. So everybody's bothering me. Anywho, so I went to design space and I went to uh, create new design, which will be my own. And I'm going to see if I can make some labels for my cash stuffing envelopes. And these are my kids. Um, Let's see. I have to keep in mind that I'm doing this for other kids. Guys, I hate to admit this, but I lost all of my footage. Oh my God. Of me making my kids um, names for their cash envelopes. But I can show you. This one. They turned out really cute. Oops. Um, I got to re-laminate that or tape it together or something because it didn't act right. That's one. And that is one. I also made a trial cup. <laughs> I just wanted to see how it would turn out. Um, and I think it's really cute. Of course, I'm going to unstick these from off of here and take them off and redo it because I didn't use the permanent paper or anything. This was just some paper I found at the Dollar Tree. Like, yes, the Dollar Tree had glitter contact paper. I did not think they were gonna come out right, but they came out so cute. I am so proud of myself. And of course, it was so time consuming to get these off of the mat. I think I did like eight or nine of them. Guys, I'm going to go ahead and conclude this video because I've showed you everything I needed to show you. And like I stated, my footage came up in my A, so I don't know what happened to that. So I'm just going to go ahead and get this stuff off this mat <laughs> and call it a day. Thanks for tuning in and watching me un unbox my new Cricut machine and making a few items. So if you got a Cricut, I hope you're enjoying it. I just bought mine on Black Friday. And I'm still learning. I'm still learning. So I'm new to this cricket world. So stay tuned for more videos from me. Thank you guys for tuning in. Have a good day.